Bienvenidos, welcome back. Today I wanna to show you guys how to log into your online textbook. The first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is go into the URL bar, hit my.hrw.com. Once you're here, you're going to use your username. You're gonna type in P as in Palm, B as in Beach, 0961, and then your student ID number. Make sure it's just the numbers. You can copy, cut, and paste that into the password. Once you do that, you should be able to log on. Again, your username is P as B0961, and then whatever your, your student ID number is. That's both your username and your password. Mine's a little different because I'm a teacher, so I'm going to use my teacher credentials. Go ahead and log in. Depending on what Spanish level class you're in, you're gonna have an orange book, a yellow book, a purple book, whatever the case may be. Go ahead and pick your correct textbook. <clears throat> For Spanish one, it's the orange book. What I wanna show you guys is what to do once you're actually in the website so that your teachers can check your homework and so you kind of understand how to use the online textbook. First things first, in the upper left-hand side, you'll see a drop-down menu. From there, you can cl click the correct textbook um, chapter, whichever your teacher's in. My Spanish one class is currently in unit four, lesson one. Once you select it, you actually have to hit go. When you hit go, it's gonna open up the textbook. So here is the textbook. If you have a specific page you need to go to, you can punch that in right here. For example, if I wanna go to page 200, I can go ahead and hit 200 in the center of the page here to do go to page. Once we're in the actual chapter, and if your teacher assigns you a specific actividad, you can do that. You're going to click on the queue. Once you click on the queue, for example, I might tell my kiddos, all right, chicos, vamos a hacer actividad 5 en la página 200. From here, you click on the queue like I did, and you're able to type in whatever you need. For here, it says, Enrique y Maribel miran un catalogo de ropa y describen la ropa que quieren ellos y otros. Usa las fotos para decir qué ropa quieren. So, right sentences describing the clothing items that these people want. Tenemos un modelo, se dice la madre de Enrique, and then the answer would be, la madre de Enrique quiere la blusa anaranjada. So we're going to do one for Maribel, just so you can see how it works. Um, Maribel. There we go, and what does she want? Maribel numero uno, I think that looks like, yep, it looks like a dress in Espanol se dice vestido. So Maribel, and then we're using what verb? The verb querer. Maribel quiere, quiere, there we go, un vestido. Oh, we're doing um, el vestido, and what color is that? El vestido rojo. Just like that, make sure you have the right accent marks. You can see, you can add them there if you need them, et cetera, et cetera. When you're finished with the activity, hit submit. If you don't hit submit, then your teacher doesn't know that you've actually completed the assignment. All right, so that's one thing that you guys can do. It's really good now to take a look at the contents. For example, if you just kind of want to zoom around, you can go directly to the in resumen, which is the review sheet of all of the vocabulary and then the basic idea of the grammar. You can see here it says page 198. Uh, for grammar notes on tener, we have stem changing verbs or boot verbs, and then direct object pronouns. So this is just kind of how you go through the chapters if there's a specific page you like for example i really like this page i'm going to have my kids go back over and over to this one so you can actually add a bookmark if you want to do that it's right here uh just like that if you want to make your page bigger go to page view make it nice and large porque yo soy ciega y soy muy vieja so i like it kind of large like this I really enjoy actually having the online textbook because it allows you guys to listen to the audio. There we go. You can also watch the videos and, and do the activity. So hopefully this has been helpful. Um, best of luck. And I will hopefully see you guys when I see you or your teachers will see you when they see you. Take care. Bye.